What's your name? Sammy. What's yours? Just an officer. Where did you learn English? In school. My father used to buy novels and movies. He took me around the world. He's a model. He's killed with people like Bruce Lee, Amitra Pashan, if you know what I mean. But I know that one day I'm gonna be like them. They taught me how to talk. That's wonderful. So where is your father now? Not important. We talk about it some other time. How about your mom? Dead and gone. What did you do for a living? I was a soldier. Do a lot of things with my hands. Killing animals and things, if you understand what I mean. That's wonderful. So, if I may ask you my friend. I'm not your friend. Don't you ever call me your friend. Because I'm no friend to police or Mopo or even warders like you. I am a soldier. And I'm a friend to soldiers like me. So, Sammy, wh where are you from? I am from USA. Oh, the United States of America. Wrong. I am from the United States of Ajigule. I am a Nigerian. Precisely. I am a proud Wafi boy. So do you have any relation here in Bukuru? I mean, brothers, cousins, brother-in-law, anyone? They are all dead and gone. Have you ever gone mad before? Yes. When I was in jail. No food, no hospital, no electricity. For God's sake, I went mad. What about homosexuality? Son, do you like men? I don't do men. I don't do men. What's wrong with you? It's okay. Now, tell me, what brought you to jail? Robbery, marijuana, heroin, cocaine, or assassination? None of the above. I was just making love to my girl, and they call it rape. Oh, so you're a rapist? I won't let you visit me, because I have a beautiful wife. I don't need your wife. I do not need your wife! The beautiful girls out there waiting for me. You better remember this. I'm no more a prisoner, man. I'm a free bird. Just be careful. What did you just say? I said bye bye. Calling that you have refused to pick the call. Maxino. Maxino. Yeah. He wants me to come for prayers. They can start without me. Look, God knows my problem, okay? Hmm? Uh -huh. What? Uh -huh. What? You don't have to come here again. It's dangerous. Look, Joe will kill you for this if he finds out. Trust me. If that's the last thing I do before I get killed, I don't mind. I'm tight. I'm going straight to heaven. Sammy, did you get my message from Maximum? You're stupid, Sammy. He's talking to your baby. 
game is up. You son of the devil. If my father is a devil, you will not stand here and you talk to me. The only reason why you're talking to me is because I'm a child of God. Take this. Same to you. And you? What are you doing here? Bring you with my boys. I beg your pardon? Who is your boy? I ask you, who is your boy? I'm going to take that as a slip of tongue, man. Huh? Let me warn you, I don't want to see you close to this ghost anymore, because he's a dead man. Sammy, follow me. Me, follow you to where? I ask you again, to where? Oh, by the way, does a dead man walk? I won't repeat my song. It is an order. Let me tell you something you do not understand. No one orders Sammy around. No one. The only one that orders me around is my mama, not even my father. That's if I had one. Sammy, you're not going to talk. But let me tell you. We'll see how you will end. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Let's get it out of here. Thank you. You sit there and you let them take her away? Huh? Huh? Hey, hey, hey! You, you walk away with my jewel, huh? Okay. No problem, all right? But when I need her, man, you gonna beg me to come take her. You understand? Ah! Hey, listen. You sat there and you let them take my jewel away. Getting drunk, and that is dangerous. Max, I play my guitar better when I'm drunk. You understand that? Sammy, why don't you listen to me? You can win some people sometimes, but you cannot win all the people all the time. I know where you're coming from. That, 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 that was Bob Marley's lyrics to make his music sweet. But even Bob knows that you can win all the people all the time.
next time you send better men to come get me. Tree that can be easily cut down. And you. Called me Luca Baba. I would have allowed you to leave where you chose to die. Shut up! Fuck you too! Shut up! I wish you not with the gun. I would have killed you with my bare hands. Fuck you. I'm on the other side now. I'm the man with the gun. I will kill you. Ah! And for you. <laughs> Don't kill me, please. Spare my life. So you don't want to die? Huh? You kill every day and night. Oh, come on, man. Don't put me to shame. You're a soldier, man. You die as one. You've enjoyed all the power, the women, the money. So I don't see any reason why you must leave. Please. I know you're a good man. Please take everything that belongs to me, even my woman. Oh, spare my life. Oh, come on, boss. Why, why are you behaving like a woman? No, I'm not the, I'm not the boss. 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 Well then, boss. I do not need your permission to have Naomi because she's already mine. You know what pains me so much? The fact that you're not going to be dead. You remember the last time you said to me that I step on the wrong toes? Now you have just done the same. And you! your name, Atifa. You work for me? Yes. And you? Get up! Yes, sir. I like your guts. Beautiful, Max. Beautiful. Thank you, boss. Risks them. Get out. Are you, are you crazy to have come into my room? Do you want to kill me? Huh? And what is this blood stain in your shirt? Blood? Yes, blood. The blood of that dog that backs at you all the time. Which dog are you talking about? Sammy, please leave before he meets you here. I beg of you, please. Does the cops work? How do you mean? 
a bastard. He doesn't deserve you. So I killed him. See, who's there? Hey! <laughs> Sorry to have kept you waiting, man. No problem, man. All right. How you doing? Fine, man. Hey, here you go. Hey. What's up, bro? We're good. Mm -hmm. How you doing? You're welcome. Man. You got the goods? Yep. So I got the money. Yeah. What's my sister doing here? Look, Sam, don't just start this trash now, huh? Leave them alone. Let's stop being with business here, yeah, right? Who start this trash? She's kissing that man in the public. Well, you kiss other people's sisters. You even kiss other people's wives, right? I do. And that's because I'm naughty. Look, I can't allow her to live the same life I lived. Zip up your mouth, or I'll zip it up for you. Why not now? Go ahead, do it. Why not now? Last time, get the hell out of here. A rich man. I see you're so strong now, but you can't run my life for me. No way, Sammy. No way. But I will tell you how to run your life. Now you listen to me. Hey, hey, hey. you listen to me. If I ever, ever find you here again, you'll be sorry for yourself. You can't order me about when I'm not your baby. I will leave when I want to leave, see who I want to see, sleep with my man anywhere I want, in the car, in the street, even in the pool. This body is mad. What? Come on! Look at that shit! She's a woman! So? Look at you. I want to make love to my boyfriend right here now. If I hear you say that statement again, let her hear it. Because I'm going to tell her that you're being made love to in a mad box. He's your brother, right? He did what he did because he loves you. I'm not your child. I'm an adult. Yeah, but well, to him you are not. You are his baby sister. I won't let him treat me that way anymore. I'm not his baby. I'm 23 years old. Listen. Just put yourself in his shoes. You can see that you're the best thing that ever happened to him. Listen, I know your brother, he loves you. I 
and he'll do anything possible to protect you. Protect me against what? Like the young man we saw trying to make love to you inside that car. Couldn't he afford a reasonable room in a hotel? Huh? No, that's really nice. Just... Better? Yes, Mom. Just... Who is that man and what does he want? He's my friend, Maxine. This is holy ground. He must not come to see you here or anywhere else for that matter. Is that clear? Yes, Mom. Go and do that and, and come inside. Can't leave them there. Let them be. Uh, listen, we can't leave them there. You can't display this kind of money. Why? It's too large a sum to display in public. Remember, they're watching you. you no, the only, only problem I have with you is that you're too touche. I don't have time for that. The only language I understand is money. This is Sammy, man. I got the money. And I just want to spend it. Look, why don't you listen to me for once, man? Look, Sammy. Listen to me for one! Don't you understand? Get up! The name of the outfit is Trinity International. Where's my people? Every one of you here was me. We do all kinds of business, but from major operation is robbery. But we're conscious. We rob high men in the society, banks, and government structures. But we do not rob from the poor masses out there. We. We are the Trinity International. And if the family needs any one of you and your mama is sick in the hospital, the family comes first. So you better watch your back. Any questions? Sammy, I'd like to know exactly what you mean by we all now work for you. Good. When I have any projects, I'll assemble every one of you. But for now, you guys can run your own thing. What I do understand from this whole discussion is that we work together as a family. We only meet when there's a project to carry out. It's my girl. Mm -hmm. See, hey, Maxima, take a look at this man. Mom, I believe in God. The one thing I want you to understand is that I don't want my mother to work for nobody. I'm among the richest men in this city. How will people feel when they see me and know that my mother is a clean and one church? I just can't place that. Sammy, I am one of the most 
most respected women in this society. How do you think I feel amongst my Christian brethren, knowing fully well that my son is one of the most notorious criminals in this country? Oh, Mama, I'm a changed person. I'm a changed man. I rob nobody, kill nobody, do good business, Mom. I support charity organizations, motherless babies home, orphanages. I mean, what else could be better than that? Even the so-called men of God, Mom, haven't done what I've done for the society. Sammy, what you are giving is known as the gift of the mermaids. Giving hundreds to a society and taking millions out of that same society. I want you to move into the new house I bought for you. New house? Bought with which money? Blood money? Mom, I don't understand you at all. Let's leave you and pack into a better place. What all these God say and Jesus say? I will leave you here and go. You don't see reason to go there. You don't understand what is going on. Sammy, I have told you. Please, leave me. If I am your mother, as you claim, then you will do what I say. Jesus Christ is the only way, the only truth, and the only life to oh, follow. Mom, anointing without money causes annoyance. It's because you don't know him. That's why you're saying all this, Father. I just don't want to talk about him anymore. I almost died because of him. Even the Bible says that if anything is going to lead us to hell, we cut it off. But even if he's a killer, you don't need to push him away. Rather, you draw him closer and show him the way to salvation. You just have to find time and sit with him. And perhaps, you come back with a testimony. Let's pray for him. Yes, I like Michael. He's nice. He's fun to be with. He knows how to make a woman happy. He knows how to treat a woman. Yes, he does. Like he was trying to make love to you inside a car the other day. You want to choose a man. Why don't you look for a responsible one? Where can I find such a man? A man. They're everywhere. You could go for a lawyer, a doctor, or some handsome, good. 
good-looking banker. And what if I see you're my kind of man? What's that? What are you trying to say? Are you drunk? Oh, stop pretending. I know you love me. I don't know what are we doing at this time. I know when a man is in love with me. No, wait. You are like a sister to me. Your brother Sami and I are like brothers from different mothers. I can't take you to bed. I am not your sister. In fact, I think I know what the problem is. I'm afraid of my brother Sami. Then come, come and kiss me now. So, Maxino? Yeah. Who is the lucky girl that has been keeping you out of sight? No, but you know I don't have time for such things. Huh? I just want my friend to enjoy his marriage to the fullest. Oh yeah, you're looking more handsome as the day pass. I was just about to call you. Yeah, Mama sent for me. Is she alright? She's fine. Woman, yeah. Max and I here have a meeting to attend to. Later in the evening, I have to go see Mama. She wants to see me. All right. Stand this anymore. Then change. I don't need anything from you, Sammy. Keep your money. Gold and silver, I have no need of that. Can't you understand In that? In that case, I'll have to force you out of here. I'm tired of all this shame. What shame? The fact that I serve a living God and that I am content with what I have. Sammy, no weapon fashioned against me will prosper. No matter what I do, I'm still your son. And it's my duty to make sure that you live a better life. I mean, how can the mother of a billionaire almost turn beggar all in the name of working for God? Sammy, you don't have any shame. Otherwise, you wouldn't let your mouth run just anyhow. Your father was not rich, but he was a man of honor. What has gotten into you? Stay out of this. Mama, he was who he was. I am who I am. Look, I want you to say bye-bye to poverty. Sammy, you have overstayed your welcome. Please, just go. Mom, he's not going anywhere. Shut up! How many times have I told you to always obey whatever your mama tells you? Don't you ever do that again. Ever. Let's get out of here. Let's, let's get out. See you around, mama. Really sorry about this, mama. I'll talk to you. Latifa confirmed the movement for Monday morning, 9.15 a.m. precisely. 
Mm. In that case, they will be going with police escort, huh? Yeah. Four. That means war. Fire for fire. Bloom for bloom. It'll be fun. Real fun. To see all those black shirts drop one by one. We must pray to God so that we go and come back. So be fun. Pray for us. Well. Let us pray. God, you know we are your children trying to survive. May you guide us through all our travels. Latifa. Latifa. Yeah. Hello, boss. Yes. I hope you guys are okay. I'm okay, boss. All right. Now remember, we are the junction that connects the major road. Yeah? You guys will definitely pass us here. Okay. I trust you, Latifa. Bye. Yeah, Maxine. I've just finished talking to the boss now. I'm coming to join you guys now. I think the mountain is finally done. Just stand by. Alright. Keeping that fool. He must not joke with us. Well, he promised to feed us back as soon as it's through with the investigation. 
Maybe he's not through what he's doing yet. I'm sure he will join us. Sammy, if we don't get any response from him after now, I suggest you send your lawyer to find out the situation. A Liberian man killed his wife this morning over betrayal. Information gathered from eyewitness said that she was murdered in cold blood by her own husband, who later said the house of Lazen tried to escape after collecting the money which was sent to him by his mother. The police arrested him and investigation is currently on. Some gang of armed robbers who recently exchanged gunshots with the police killed some policemen while the policemen also brought one of the robbers down. He is now in a stable condition in the hospital receiving treatment, which after will face the law. Meanwhile, investigation is still going on to get the rest of the members of the gang. Now, sports. Bring that the match gun. between the Super Eagles and the Czech Republic only two We must not allow them to reach us now. Well, the problem is we don't know if he's dead or not. That is not necessary. If the man is still alive, then he just has to die. But the hospital name was not mentioned. I mean, how do we know the location? Information, man. Information. Every dog has a tail. That's what you call yourself, and that's what it is. Wood, iron, stone, that's your name. Look, I got it. Let's see. There is nothing. Nothing you can do about it. Yes. I think you're tired of leaving. Get out of my way, bitch. Your mama's a bitch. My tried. church council <laughs> you know that is not true this is your brother it is his time yes mom it looks like something that he can do now you call him and tell him to come and pack his properties from my house and return mine otherwise i will call the police the police on your own son that vagabond is not my son So, are you in charge of the work? 
two of you, come on, from jump here, quickly. Come on, quickly. We're very sorry, sir. Excuse me, doctor. Yes, officer. How may I help you? I'm looking forward to where the suspect is on admission. Give us a message for you. You guys have come to take me away from here. Yes, oh. that is exactly what we're here to do. Oh, I'm so glad. What? What is he doing out there? You know, how did you guys get in here? Don't worry about that. He's been taken care of. Uh, oh, bro. So, um, how are you responding to treatments? Oh, I'm doing good, bro. And let me help you out with this. Here to make peace between you and your mother. My son, what's the problem between you and your mother? Father, I do not have any problem with my mother. All I'm saying is that my mother should not work here or anywhere else. That's all. But why did you want her to work in the house of God? The only God that people know and respect today is money. Father, I believe in Almighty God. And if the only way to serve and make heaven is to be poor, I prefer hell. What I'm saying, Father, is this. I love my mother more than anything in the whole world. I don't want to suffer anymore. Father, you see what I'm talking about? Please, he needs deliverance. Help him. My son, I am not against the love you have for your mother. It is only the devil that makes a child to hurt his mother. If you love your mother, then you've got to listen to her. It is one of the commandments in the Bible. The children should obey their father and their mother so that their days on earth may be long. All I want is for him to pack his properties from my house and return mine. That's all. See what I'm saying, Father? My mother is the only woman that I know that is poor and proud. Tell her, Father, that poverty is a sin. And the only way to make heaven is for her to be rich. Wherever you are, without Christ, is useless. Madam, please don't tell him to take those things back. He did those things out of love. Just try to pray for him. After all, only God knows your heart. Oh, Father, this is the time to face reality. I am fed up with a system where bishops, pastors, and, and fathers ride in big cars, build houses out of tithe and offerings of members. Every one of you is rich, and all you do is come to church and you tell your members to praise the Lord, and they stupidly raise their hands to heaven and shout, Hallelujah. I am not down with that.
Nice talking to you, Father. Mama, I still love you. Is that for me, sir? Sit down. Inspector Buba, what I want to tell you is this. If I am going down, you... Yes, sir. Thank you so much. I will always stop by to let you know our preparations. It's okay. Meanwhile, try your best to pray about it, like I have said. Because when good things are about to happen in one's life, the devil will always fight against them. I have come to realize that, Father. But we would also want you to put us in prayer. Father, my only problem is my mother and how to convince her. I would like you to come in for us. It's okay. Leave that for me. By the grace of God, I will handle it. I will. Meanwhile, Maxwell, Father, don't answer Maxino. Maxwell is a better name. Remember, that is the name your parents gave to you. that talks to me and I listen is my pocket. Money is power, man. Without it, you're dead. So get rich or die trying. Without my money, this beach here won't be looking beautiful. Excuse me? Money drops, bullshit walks. She knows I'm gonna get rich. That's why she's following me. With money, you can get everything. You're not eating. I lost my appetite. Now don't you tell me it's one of your ploys to waste my money. I mean, why won't you lose your appetite, girl? When you drink everything and smoke everything. Sammy. You can't even give me a baby. Sammy. I married a junkie for a while, man. Sammy, you're a fool. A big fool. You don't have shame. That is why you sit down here and open your big mouth to talk to me. Look at you. Just fucking look at you. Do you know what it's be a man, you know? Now me, that's it. Tell me. How can I have a baby when I sleep with a fellow woman? Shut up! Hey! How can you have a baby when your whole system is polluted with alcohol, Sir. man? Well, look Sir. at the stone talking to me. You oh. are a stone, Andrew. I don't blame you but myself. You destroyed my life and happiness. I swear you, Sammy. You will pay it back in full. I am leaving now. Please, Maxine. Please, please. No. Eh? Then I go. No one threatens me, man. The only thing that threatens me is my. You overreacted on this, and I don't like it. Fuck you. Fuck you! Fuck you, Fuck man! You Fuck you too! Fuck you! That's your wife we're talking about, man! That's your wife! Who are you to question my actions, man? Who the fuck are you? Okay. Okay. Friends are weak. Look at it, man! Why don't you ever listen to me for once? 
to understand why we must quit this job. You see, God has been with us all this while. We've got to give up crime, Sammy. I'm sure we can find better things to do. Did you see what I've just done with my hand? Yes, you just waved your hands. Then you're not drunk. You must be crazy. I mean, because the man I just spoke with is not the Maxino that I know. Sammy, you're right about that. This is not the Max Dino that you used to know. This is Maxwell Oduma. And I tell you, Sammy, we've got to give our lives to God. I cannot continue to waste the lives of other people. Max. Go and sleep. I'll call you later. Then we can talk. I'm sure by then you would have come to your senses. I will be attending my Bible classes then. So we better make it tomorrow. Thank God for your life. Don't let anything attract you to them again. And try your best to get Sammy, your friend, to change, just as you have done. Well, Father, I, I try to talk to him every day. But my friend Sammy is, is a difficult person to come in. He does what he has made up his mind to do. Well, Madam, by the grace of God, I know your son in law will finally get Sammy back home. I'm convinced in my spirit that this marriage is divine. And so we need to put them to prayer. Yes. Father. What else do I do morning, noon, and night but pray? It's my only weapon. Mom, thank you very, very much. I won't disappoint you. Father, thank you. Thank you so much. I'm very grateful. Honor be to God on this. Yeah, Maxwell, have you informed your friend about your wedding plans? Mm, no, not really, Father. Uh, I intend to surprise him. <laughs> but I will tell him. I will definitely tell him. That's a good one. Then let's pray for him.
call, sir. And then you said you should call immediately in return, sir. Put him on the line. Let's find out what he wants from me. Provoke me, Sammy. Why do you answer my question with question? Are you stupid? What happened between you and my cousin Naomi? So, 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 so you have the mouth to insult the man that fits you because of a bitch, huh? Sammy, you insult me. I think you have made enough money. That's why you can open your mouth and talk to who made you anyhow. I'll cut into size. You threatened me, huh? You threatened me, huh? Who, who the hell are you? Who the hell do you think you are? Threaten me, huh? 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 I'm gonna teach you what your mama never taught you. You understand? Know you like manners, and I'm gonna bother you, son. You know what the problem is? Huh? Talk to me. You know what the problem is? Poverty. Poverty. Get rich, man. Get rich. Get rich. And stop fighting for a bitch. You understand? Why don't you die? That, huh? Huh? You want bloodbath? I'll give you bloodbath, man. You wanna go to war? You want to go to work with me? You don't know who you're talking to, man. Harlem, you are dead! You are dead! Your family, your mom, your sister! Everybody! You know what the problem is? You know what the problem is, man? Poverty! Poverty! Why don't you get rich, man? Stop fighting for a bitch! You understand? Why don't you die, Sally? All right. Go on, Walk. Walk. I'll talk to my guys. I'll give you blood back. Walk. I'll give you blood back. Get out! See everyone here. Already have their own bags. And I have yours here with me. Do it the same old way. That is why you invited me, son. I don't want this kind of money anymore. And I want you all here to know that the man you used to know as Maxino is dead. The person sitting right here in front of you is Maxwell Odumu. Now work for Christ. And I'm inviting all of you to join me in the service of the living God, the Lord of Lords, Alpha and the Omega. 
Surrender your lives to Him. He will accept and forgive your sins. <laughs> Shut up! What funny? God that I know and I worship is this nothing else. Sam, there's a greater God that created this God that you worship. I will leave you all now. to invite you to the police station to explain to us the socks of your wet. You want to know what I do? I'm a businessman. Why don't you tell us that when we get to the station? Officer, don't get into this mess because of this thing. I can prove your uniform to you. It's nothing but an armory. You prove that in court. Officer, I told you. I have one of the best lawyers the country can handle. So my advice to you is don't get involved. Even if you pull yourself out of this, I will still cut you down, Sammy. That I promise you. You tell us that you don't get to the station. I ain't going to You understand? I own this house. I own this city. I run things here. This belongs to me. Yeah? Mm hmm Boy, Sam! Get him. All right. All right, all right. Take it. All right. Mr. Mahmoud! Okay, all right. Take it easy, man. I'll go with you. Yeah? Will you speak to my wife? Let's go. You hear me? Yeah. See you, brother. Easy, easy. All right. What I have to tell is to watch your back. A woman that can sit to her before the police can kill if she has the meat. No one can kill me. You don't worry about that. Right? I cut their hearts according to their sizes. They plan to lock me up, but they failed. With a lot of practice, they will not succeed. See you tomorrow. Meanwhile, before if there's any call from the police, tell them to talk to me. Will do. Right away. Keep it straight. Hey. Let's do it tonight. It doesn't matter how you put it. Make sure you keep in touch. So meet my guest guys, huh? Straight. Oh. I'll be right away to you. Okay. Catch you. Mom, must she go to church every day? Oh, she wants to. She has given her life to Christ. She is now a child of God. And um, by God's grace, she'll be getting married soon. No. My sister is not getting married. She can't get married now. She's still very young. If you need money, tell me. I'll give you more than enough. Don't sell my sister off now. Not now. She's still a kid. And how can she plan such a thing without telling me? I guess she wants to surprise you with it. 
Tell her to see me. I have something for her. Something like what? You don't need it. So why worry about it? If you don't tell me what it is, you will not see her. I want her to go to America. I have a visa for her. Today's her birthday, and I wanted to surprise her with it. Things, things, things. Why don't you surprise her by giving your life to Christ? Oh, that would be such a beautiful birthday present. Oh, no. Not now. Please, not now. Maybe some other time. Maxino, where are you? Yeah, one minute, man. Hey. Sam, what's up? I'm all right. How are you doing? Good, man. Latifa, hey, how are you doing? I'm cool. So, good afternoon. I left a message at your place. Let me see. No! <laughs> no! No! Wait up! Wake up! What have you done? What? We're getting married tomorrow. I sent your cards home.
You have been such a great friend. I don't know how I can live my life without you now. Sami, we are like brothers. And because of that, I have the intention to make our friendship an everlasting one. To achieve that, I want to marry your kid sister, Rebecca. I hope that this will cement our friendship forever. I know this will come to you as a surprise, but that's how I want it to be. Please, we will need your blessing on our wedding day. Your friend forever and brother-in-law, Maxwell Oduma. We both love you in Jesus' name. Amen. My prince, I'm proud of you, no matter what. I know that every time you fight for me, you're doing that because of the love you have for me. If you don't love me, you won't mind me. What I want to tell you now may sound funny, but without you, I would never have found this happiness that I have today. I have decided not to tell you this until today, being my birthday, because I know you always want to make me happy on my birthday. And so, my prince, I want you to please give me your love by supporting us in this wedding. Because of me, your friend quits crime just to make sure that you will have no reason to say no to this our great dream of being man and wife. <laughs> Thank you in advance, your kid sister, Rebecca. We know that one day, You'll be joining us and serve the Lord. We love you so much. One love. <laughs> no, 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 you can't leave me. <laughs> no! I'm so sorry, so sorry, so sorry, so sorry. Oh my God, my God. <laughs> 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 
fuck with me, huh? Look at you! Come dance with me! You wanna fuck me, huh? You wanna dance? It's time to dance! Come on! Shake it up with me! Please just calm down. What were you saying? Okay, please, please, can you repeat that? Are you, are you, are you sure? Sammy? Sammy, my son, are, are, are you sure? Thank you. What, 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 what was that? I really can't drive myself now, but they, they say that God's ways are not the ways of men. God has forgiven you your sins and if God has saved your friend and your sister, would you not rather save him? That's not possible. I killed him. I killed my best friend. Sammy very well. And I 
I know exactly how he would have reacted to my relationship with his sister. Yeah? And even if I told you, Mama, you wouldn't have believed me. Tell me, dream. Tell me, I'm dreaming. Because I'm alive, brother son. Life. I'm a child of God, son. The child of God does not die just like that. After you shot me and left, I and Rebecca this what god have mercy on sammy what do we do now my body is shaking Living God. <laughs> 